nobody can use, but it's really nice. Yeah. And doesn't that kind of suck when you find the things that's like, oh, damn. Trousers of stuff. talent, oh, plus two wits, plus ten water resistance, plus ten air resistance, 117 health, 60 armor, and 295 magic armor. Is that is it Intel in pants or strength pants? Everyone's interested, in, interested in that. That's not for me, that's for you guys. Those are Intel pants, so that's me and you, Josh. And me. No. It's like all the females in the group all of a sudden have intelligence, and I'm the only guy who doesn't. <laughs> I, I am a <laughs> go, hybrid. Oh, thank you. Suddenly, I feel under Oh, Quirkus. You see, you see, I would, but I'm wearing constitution armor right now. Shield. Marcus is doing a thing. Oh my yeah. god, they're... Look at all the burning <laughs> magisters. <laughs> There's every chance the servants of the great acorn will skin you alive. Frying your bones. Those pants actually helped me significantly. You could Welcome. suffer most terrible. I am getting to the point, Quirkus. The point is... You now have more magic armor than Roth again. Is dangerous. Mm-hmm. My physical armor is still laughable. I have watched you defeat monsters, villains, and a surprising number of inanimate objects. <laughs> Your greatest <laughs> challenge yet lies before you. I do not know what lies ahead. Oh, hey guys, check out this guy's artwork. We are here. currently... What fur? You're dead! The forces of evil will throw everything they have against us, but I need more time to finish my research. You have been a He's good speaking student, metaphorically. <laughs> I, both believe you can buy us I don't know why, but I just had a sudden need. urge of anger, but yet I'm, I'm proud. <laughs> I'm angry at you, skies. but I'm proud of now, you. It will take more than Quirkus's ferocity and my wit if you're going to survive. You oh. need power, and Should I give us something. I have just the thing. Oh, no. After our last little escapade with your void woman. I examined the corpses you left behind. They were imbued with dark power. I believe I sorry, the Quirkus believes <laughs> and I concur. Don't tell me those don't tell me where I should keep my eyes at. As well as Dare you dark. the squirrel lays his hand on you, and a strange feeling ripples through your body. A sense of power. Your mind opens to the possibilities of new magic. Oh. Now, how do you think it feels, Quirkus? The spell is a little unusual, I admit. It harnesses the power of those that you see. Wait, what level are we get? What level are we uh, getting? Are we? I don't know. However, you're thinking about 18. 18. Oh. I admit, I thought it was a beautiful little piece of irony, but it is somewhat grim. I'll grant you that. But if you need proof that grim arts can lead to marvelous things, Aww. you need only look. At now you have all the power you need. You were a wonderful shield as we fled, but we are not running anymore. Now you must become the axe. Hey. Go, my friend, and lay waste to the forces of the acorn. Hatch them to pieces. Snap their spines and burn their eyes. Um. And Quirkus. Uh, huh. <laughs> Two new recipes learned. What are they? I don't know. I'm about to find out. Bloodstorm skill book and a bloodstorm skill book. Yeah. I already know how to make it. Well. That was... Okay. That is... Actually a really pretty artwork. <coughs> man works at a canvas, mounted on an easel. Smears of what must be red paint are evident on his hands and clo- He momentarily Okay, so, while we are here, we have to do something. Uh-huh. We have to find the last piece of my armor. This will be my masterpiece. Hmm. I usually only display gestures to the canvas. It's completely covered in the same shade of red, layer after layer. It's sodden, dripping onto the cobbles. Hey, uh, hey, Roth. Yeah? I found the shield. Okay. Mm -hmm. You're a dying breed around here, my friend. Oh, Nobody blame? Uh, I found another items that I 
Red didn't realize the I had. Here's shape. this one. Okay, we need to find the Magister Barracks. Yeah. Back the sleeve of his That's the quest. To a blood oh, it's right over here. Perfect. <laughs> oh. <laughs> oh. Wow. Oh. What? What did you find? This dude's painting with his own blood. Ooh. It was my father's technique. He was the finest painter of his generation, and he used his own blood for his masterwork. Oh, the final there's an execution final, going on. Sacrifice of he was also quite there is. Lucian's balls. That's amazing. <laughs> Hold on. I want to see the effects. execution. Where is it held? They're going to kill a paladin. A paladin is killing a paladin. Huh. Self-preservation is a petty concern. I must put the spiritual above the corporeal. I, for the most part, a copy can be seen at the original panel, the one that my father used his blood to depict Lucian's final sacrifice. Oh, she broke it. He well, that's it locked thing away somewhere in that mansion of his. Get it, get it. Get your ass up here. Where? Oh. There's Roth. Talk to Lord Kem. Never mind. Never she mind. Long. I was <clears throat> talking to someone else. In Lucian's name. Now, the back to your duties. There's much to do. Well, shit. Well, I mean, she did. She did break break an oath. That don't mean shit. I welcome you, comers and natives alike. The elf stands in front of a cart displaying various sundries. He warmly motions to you and gives you a broad smile. Well, we missed out on a quest. <clears throat> oh, do we need a uh, pixie dust and bone dust? Uh, stardust, I mean? Yeah. It helps uh, create uh, runes, I think. Yeah, runes. Well, this guy's selling it, that's why I was asking. <laughs> I found yeah, a crumpled actually. note on a magister's corpse. It says, Ooh. destroy after reading. Purity of mind, order of society, disciple of, uh, er, not disciple, discipline of body and loyalty shield. to the divine. Uh, Zerg, there's some armor here for this guy that you might want to get. Namely the, uh, like a lot of weapons. namely the iron body armor. If you don't want it, I would like it. Don't fret, my lady, it's okay. Well, I'm also very... This stuff's expensive. Oh. Hey, Josh. Yeah? Watch my armor. Okay. <laughs> Damn. You're beating me by four points in magic armor. <laughs> this is unacceptable. And if Zerg gets me some more, like the beautiful husband that he is, I'm gonna be trouncing you. What? What armor is you wanting? Uh, that chest piece. Uh, is it the one that's called Iron Body Armor? Yeah. Here you go, Roth. Smooch. <laughs> hey, Josh, look at my armor again. I don't like you. I'm halfway. <laughs> I'm halfway to two thousand physical. I don't like you. I am halfway to two thousand. Well, I have half of two thousand. Is there a guy? Is there a guy that sells? I can't open the hatch. Josh. Zerg. Give, give Were moments. you wanting those enforced pants to wear? Ouch. That hurt. Zerg. Shouldn't we be enforcing pants for Flame? He, yes, I not. am wearing pants. Are you wanting those enforced Currently. pants? I didn't see those pants yet. I just got insulted, Roth. <laughs> Who dares? She says, don't touch the merchandise. Your oily skin will appear and taint everything on here. Listen here, <laughs> bitch. <laughs> Summer's still good. What you looking for? Oh my god, with the belt though she has. I will end as you. As hey Josh. Yes. Uh what damage does your staff do? Hunters, I've got the uh give me a moment, I'm looking at the trader here. Um, staff, staff, staff. 
74 to 91 fire, plus 3 intelligence, atrophy oh, acid. I was going to say, if you like a magical elven staff that does 90 to 111 poison damage, plus 6 in initiative, oh, no. plus 10% crit chance, and plus 3% cleave damage. Terrible things I yes, do. yes I would. I smell fear and blood okay, I'll get and that. And get death that. And uh, something else. Something worse. It's coming from under the city. Do you need hey any guys. Full break for a second. Yeah. Something's coming from underneath the city. Huh? Um. Now you guys want to stop going that way and come here real quick? We're uh, just here you go, looking Josh. at traitors. But yeah, I just talked to a permanent, permanently blind dog, and he said, "What's <clears> going <throat> on? I smell terrible things. I do. I smell fear and blood and doom and death and something else, something worse. It's coming from under the city." That's concerning. Lucian's coming back from the dead. Lucian's balls. It could probably use uh, everything from new gloves, belt, and boots if you find I'm that, sir. Oh, you need yeah. new, you need new boots, helmet. Boots in the helmet. Boots, gloves, belt, and helmet. My uh, armor's pretty good, but. I mean, I don't, I don't want your wife, no matter how big of titty she has, I have a husband. But, but like, big? Oh my god, Zerg. What? Armor. Armor. Oh my god, Roth, you got so much more armor than me, but I have For so much you. more health than you. There's armor here for you. You, you know that uh, woman we tried to save her wife, time? I imagine she's pissed. She just randomly stopped me. It's like, you, you, you did save her. And I'm like, um, I wasn't the one who promised. Don't lay this on me. Why are you staring at a basket flame? Oh, right, hatch. Is there anyone that's selling ru runes at all? There's a guy that's selling a bunch of rune materials. Oh, uh, where is he at? Right next to the one you were talking to. Oh, the blacksmith? No, but that's where the armor is. You just walk past yeah. this guy. Oh! Ah, uh, he sells the materials to make it, okay. Look out! I see a trap nearby. Careful! I've spotted a trap. <clears throat> so shall I set off these traps? There's something behind this painting. More magister trickery. They must have many Mine. secrets to go to all these lengths. Found one. Careful, I've spotted a trap. That didn't sound successful. Oh, I think I reset it. Huh. There's something behind this painting. Hey Josh, go push that uh Oh wait, shit. Button? Uh yeah. hold on, wait, 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 wait. What? Mine. Body. Now do the other one. Divine. No, no, that's the last one. We need to find. The, there's four buttons. We need to find the fourth one. Check behind the paintings. Aha! Painting. What's this? I found something. Found society. Okay. Mind. Body. Now do society. Now do divine. Didn't nope. Sound successful. Door open. Sorry, my character doesn't avoid poison traps. Now that's
that's just there. Josh, move. If you guys are done looting down here, I'm gonna go back up there with Zerg. Oh wait, no, there's more over here. Ooh. Hey Josh, come here. Never mind. It's a mom. Hey Josh. I yes, have fine. a giant poison vial. Ooh, I like those. Hey Zerg, are you near a um a shopkeep right now? Oh yeah, I've been running back and forth to shopkeepers to see what they got. Well, I'm about to send you a bunch of paintings. <laughs> I like the way you think. Steal Where? all of those things. Where's my... my... Armor okay, piece? so... No, don't pick up. Roth, you said there's a pair of pants in here, you said? Oh, no, no. Uh, Josh, you Oh my god. <laughs> okay. Um you see yourself in the mirror. It's quite a sight. I'm just gonna steal these paintings. <coughs> They're magisters, who cares? Geists down here. There are what? Geist. There's geist down there? Yeah. Too loud. You know, Dallas is creature. Yeah. <laughs> I don't like that. What, the fact that there are geists no. down here? No, that will just murder. But no, I clicked the sewer grate and... My character said, I hear the sound of running water, nothing more. <laughs> well, that just means you hear the sound of running water, and nothing more. I don't like it. I'm gonna start combat. Alright. Hey, Roth. Yes. I now have 4,530 hit points. <coughs> nice. Hi, Flynn. Howdy ho. This is a literally Divinity Choker. Yes. Yeah. <laughs> I am Divinity Choker. <laughs> Target's just out of range. Damn. So, are you guys in combat right now? Kind of, some of us. Flame, what color are you again? Red. I'm red. If you hover over it, it tells you who's bad. I'm not even in combat, what the fuck? Yeah. That happened to me too. I sneaked closer and popped off my ethereal storm. If you want to wait and let them uh, do their shenanigans, it's just a barrel here. Don't worry about it. Would we do shenanigans? When do we not? 
You're talking about the oil barrel? No. It was just a regular barrel. It was Josh. God, they're either frozen or stunned. Or all the above. Well, that's an explosion. Oh, thanks, Flint. Uh, Zerg, you just unfroze one of them. You literally the set the whole place on fire. On. You Jesus. ignited all of the oil. This place was set to go off. It only just stopped. <laughs> One's still stunned, one's still frozen, and one's like... What the what? hell happened? <laughs> Josh I set off all of the I oil did. in the building. No, no I did not. <laughs> what Zerg did, oh, Flame. Damn it, Cody. <laughs> you're lucky you're outside my range, because otherwise I'd put you in fucking cryostasis. Yeah, but then I could be completely useless. I'm sitting here going... Exactly, that's the point. Also, you realize they'd all go for you guys. I was like sitting here going, also, come for me. <laughs> the fire missed me somehow. That's impressive. <laughs> I was just in the perfect pixel. Magic pixel it is. You can put the guys in cryo, and that way we can just destroy the other two. Oh, I got my blitz attack. I was able to attack them both. But of course, they all have damn armor. You know, I didn't get me something that gives me, uh... Oh, right, I do. I got Superconductor. Well, that works. Yeah, we need more fire. I mean, if you want. You're welcome for removing their armor. You also removed my armor. Yeah, you're welcome. <laughs> oh well. <laughs> huh. I see, I see flame holes grudges. Mm. You, you, you're just coming to this realization? <laughs> Did you just with teleportation? Yep. Nice. <laughs> so I'm just like, fuck this shit, I'm killing everything. To be honest yeah. with you, you didn't even really need us. No, I didn't. I didn't even ask for your guys' help, I just told you I was starting combat um. and you guys followed. <laughs> Now wait for everything to clear. Should I open this chest or is this gonna be a no-no? I would say no. Okay. Let, let, let it... just... <laughs> Put the fucking chest down. <laughs> <laughs> I mean, he's got the carrying capacity. I don't care. Fine, take your damn chest. I was gonna be funny. <laughs> Okay. I'm gonna I go back to exploring. Funny. I'm gonna go to the tavern. Isn't that potentially like the chest has flame's armor piece? They're trying to bring Brackus Rack. The Magisters are trying to bring Brachus Rex back to life. What the fuck? Come on, damn you. Stop bleeding. So that's why they're stealing sorcerers. Fresh bandages upon a steadily bleeding leg wound. From they were an order created then, worshipping Brachus Rex. Worse. Damn it! The paladin grits her teeth and readjusts her grip on the wound. I'll be a miss from this world soon if this bleeding... One of the magisters. Hey, what color was your pyramid again? Threw the spear into my knee. You, can you know, if you hover it. over it, it'll tell you. Oh, right. I didn't give him a chance to land a second blow. Oh, who's this person heaving over and <laughs> my dying? thanks. This is just what I need. The potion takes effect, 
but then your ear catches Wait, the faintest can't we sound just of angry do whispers less on and them? the bleeding suddenly I'm... intensifies. What I'm going the to do. Claps her hand over the wound. Oh. What's going on? It looks like Where the hell Thank you. are my magic pants? Wait. No. Oh. It's starting again. The paladin is still trying to stem the flow of blood. Huh. Oh, she's dead. <laughs> oh, Mind magic grenade? Yeah, that's right. I'm sorry. What? <laughs> <laughs> well, you see, it's a grenade of mind maggots. Keep that away from me, or I'll heal you to death. <laughs> <laughs> Have you talked to this dog yet, Roth? Yes, that's who told me there's something underneath the city. Bewitched mob. It is still and silent. A visitor. Tell me. Do you like puppets? I don't Do like, you like your puppets? voice. So does anyone have an the empty grenade? And smiles, clearly not listening to a word you say. Wonderful. Here, For um, take a look at reasons. The I did. <laughs> you check my inventory. Impressive, no? <clears throat> There's a lot of craftsmanship in that small package. How is your inventory now, cleaner than flames, Zerg? I haven't had many I don't know. Of late. What I take offense to that. Hubbub that's been going on outside. Source, what else? Each and every one of my darlings has a little bit of magic in them. It turns a mere toy into a friend. I'm on good terms with the divine order. They know what my... Oh, no, not at all. I use only the smallest sprinkle of source in my work. I'd hard... Consider me at your service if you need anything. He sells a lot of toys. A holy hand grenade. Some cursed grenades. Oh. Oh, I'm just gonna... I'm just gonna buy that. Doing quite well for a toy maker. <clears throat> the puppet looks at you with what almost amounts to curiosity. You detect. No, this isn't a bar. This is a toy shop. You just figured that out. Yeah. Oh, it's down here. Ooh, this guy looks interesting. Last right skill book. Goods bought and sold. No questions asked. Okay. The man glowers from under his hood. You can't see his eyes, but they call you a slayer of giants. If you strike from the shadows as effectively as you strike, as there, a this should get a bunch of money. You may find my supplies invaluable. More likely than you think, but it means keeping your pride in check. But he's standing right there. Hubris gains the attention of wicked eyes. Luckily, I have the tools you need. Is there more on your mind? Oh, hey, Flame. I'm going to regret saying this, but you want silencing stare. Pretty have it. Oh. Well then. <clears throat> Is there any uh, necromancy books you're looking for? Because this dude sells them. I will need to take a look. He's still looking for his pants. I mean, not pants. It, it, it's a different uh, piece. I think it's a helmet. Head to the sewers. Those fancy dwarves down there are gorging on the goods. Hmm. Apparently, there's dwarves in the sewers. I hate it when that happens. 
That's the end of that episode.